Well, it is a quiet evening out there right now in Hagerstown, but going over into the Frederick area, we're seeing temperatures coming to be into the 20s already this evening. Temperatures in Frederick right now, they are at 30 degrees actually in Frederick, but we're going to be cooling off even more as we go along. Five miles an hour wind out of the northwest. It makes it feel like it's 25 out there, so if you go out there, go into D.C. or Baltimore tonight, you definitely want to bundle up. Temperatures around the area, 23 in Bedford, 21 in Cumberland, 14 degrees over in Oakland right now. So definitely very chilly air. Plus, the wind chill factor doesn't make it any better. Feels like six above zero over in Oakland, 20 degrees in Martinsburg, 21 in Hagerstown. So road temperatures, this is a, um, a estimate road temperature. So if um, we're going to talk about here, some, here in a few minutes, some snowfall that we're going to be planning on seeing. So everything right now from, um, let's say, the Allegheny, towards the west, you guys are either at or below freezing. So um, snowfall is more likely to accumulate on the road surfaces, especially once it gets below 27. You can see most of this area out in Garrett County and Somerset County are already below that mark. Here in Hagerstown, however, we're at 34 right now, so we shouldn't see too much in the way of accumulations on the roadways, but do take it careful over the next few days as we are experiencing this winter weather. We see this winter weather going to be moving through tomorrow morning, but then dissipating by tomorrow afternoon. We still have the chance of seeing some rain showers in on our Monday. We could see a mixing with that as well. Snowfall potential mostly going to be at less than a half an inch for most areas. This is one of our models um, right now showing only just about a half an inch, mostly in our Pennsylvania counties north of the Mason-Dixon line. But here's, here's my outlook for it. Just a few flurries over on the ICE 270 corridor as you go up I-81 up into Hagerstown as well as Chambersburg. You see you can see a trace up to an inch or uh, up to a half an inch. Um, um, back into the Alleghenies, you can see anywhere from a half an inch up to one inch of rain. We do have some winter weather advisories for our Pennsylvania counties, excluding Adams County. They're part of this big conglomerate. Most of the snowfall is going to be falling in that area. And you can see that snow on our satellite and radar as high pressure starts to move in, making our winds come out of the west and northwest. Those will change over the next few days and could be coming out of the south. 22 degrees tonight, and those winds are going to come southerly uh, with clouds going to be increasing with the chance of snow coming for your day tomorrow. 35 degrees is going to be your t high temperature tomorrow with that chance of snow. Not much in the way. We could, if we could be, if we're lucky, we'll see a light dusting out there. And now, zone by zone, we see we're going to be in the mid 30s for here Washington County, and then going into the eastern panhandle, we're going to see mid 30s as well. 34 for Berkeley Springs, 38 in Woodstock, 34 in Berryville. And then moving towards the Potomac Highlands, we're going to be seeing 38, 35 in Kaiser, 36 in Romney. Then moving into Mountain Maryland, we're going to see 34 degrees. They can see anywhere from a, an inch to an in, or half an inch to an inch of snow with more southerly winds, 10 to 15 miles per hour. Southern Pennsylvania, you guys are mostly in the 30s, um, as well as uh, in Frederick County, upper th or 30s for you guys as we go down the I-270 corridor towards D.C., 39 degrees in Silver Spring. Most of Northern Virginia, you guys are also into the mid to upper 30s to around 40, 41 in Alexandria. And as well as Woodbridge. And I'll have your